You have a question? Oh yes, I have an answer. Hey guys, thanks so much for clicking on the video. This is another episode of Ask James. Let's get to our email. I'm writing because I really need your help. I've been in a relationship with my boyfriend for four years and we've been living together for two years. I recently found out that he's been cheating with not one, but two women. I am completely devastated. I gave this man my heart and look what I got in return. I feel so ashamed because I still love this man, and for financial reasons, I have not let the relationship left the relationship yet. I don't know what to do, and I don't understand why I still love him. I know that I need to let this go, but I don't know how. Do you have any advice? Thanks in advance. And then I sad, heartbroken, and confused. Uh. It's really, you know what, the, the thing is, it's really cut and dry. It's really cut and dry. You already said it yourself. You know you need to leave. You need to leave, um, but due to financial reasons, you have not left. Um, that's ugly. That's an ugly, ugly place to be because you're basically sitting and being miserable because of finances. And the thing is, what is it that you're standing to lose? Is it that you you don't want to change the way you live? Or is it you don't make enough money to even sustain yourself? You know, um, there's definitely going to have to be changes if you're going from one income to you know, from two incomes to one income, you have to expect that there's definitely going to be some changes in your lifestyle. Um, but me personally, um, if you've been watching me any amount of time, you know I have a real bad thing about cheating and infidelity and that whole thing. I couldn't sit up underneath it. If I had to give up something, he'd be the thing that I'd be giving up. I, I just, I can't live under those pressures. I can't do that. I can't play around with you and know that you're being unfaithful to me. There's no way. I don't know how people do it, how they will know that their mate is cheating and they can lay in the bed and have sex with that person. There's no way I could give myself to you knowing that you're giving yourself to other people. I just, I can't do it, not knowingly. So you just, the only advice I have is you, stop playing. Stop beating around the bush. Stop playing. Get your ass up and go on and do what it is you need to do. You need to get out of that situation. You're miserable. You're miserable. And I can see it in the letter, you know, from what you just the small. It's a small letter, but it's powerful. The few things you said, let me know. You're not happy. You are not happy in that situation. You need to get out of that. You do whatever it is that you need to do to get out of that because there's nothing. You're home. When you go home, you're supposed to be at peace when you go home. If you don't have peace at home, where are you getting peace from? You know, you're just literally just dealing with stress all day long, 24 hours a day, seven days a week. How does that work? And I promise you it won't work for you long. You'll be laying on somebody's table or on a slab somewhere. You need to be real with yourself and get yourself up out of that situation. Two women? No. No God. It's time to go. You need to do whatever it is you need to do. Get up out of that. Get up out of that. Absolutely. That's my advice. Stop playing. That's my advice. Stop playing. Move on. Get moving. And then you're playing around with him and Mr. Wright may be out there and you're going to miss him because you're in there playing with Mr. Mediocre, when you supposed to be with who you're supposed to be with, and it's not him. So that's my advice, baby. Get up, get moving. All right, later. 
you have something you need to get off your chest or something you need some help with, I'll give it my best shot. Send me an email to spillitboy at gmail.com and in the title line, you want to put Hey James to make sure that I actually see it. If you don't put Hey James in the subject line, I'm not going to see it. It's going to continue to be an issue. So send me an email and we'll talk about it later.